Hi, I am Dr. Bruce Allian, designer of the World PRP Tube. I have the pleasure today to explain you in a few steps the way to use the tube in order to get your customized PRP. The first step is how to draw the blood. The second step will be preparing and filling the kit. The third step will be centrifuge. And finally, we will discuss how to prepare the plasmatic fractions you need in different ways uh, so as to obtain a pure and rich PRP. In order to prepare the blood sample, you would need the classical butterfly. The green one will do. You will need a syringe to draw blood. 30 ml will be fine. You can do that with a 25 ml too. And of course, you will need the anticoagulant. That can be ACDA or citrate, depending on which country you are using it. We're going now to prepare the syringe itself with a little bit of anticoagulant. We use 2 ml of the anticoagulant. Here we are. Okay, I'm taking my time in order to show you precisely. So now the syringe is ready. We're gonna connect the butterfly and draw the patient's blood. So the blood sampling is very important in order to take care of the platelets. You will notice that we aspirate very gently so that we don't harm them. Now that your syringe is filled with the patient's blood, we need to inject the blood into the kit itself. Every tube comes with a single connector tube that can be used to mix different plasmatic fractions or to mix with HA in case you are doing cosmetic medicine. The way to inject properly the blood is to do that through the plastic wrap. You will just open the lateral shaft through the plastic bag, open the bag, getting rid of that, and now you will simply inject the blood in a completely sterile way. Here again, please you note that you are treating in a gentle way the platelet so you don't harm them. We are going now to open the compartment chambers so that the blood will be concentrated in the lower compartment. The usual way to do so is to open one turn and maybe a small quarter. Then you will twist the lower part until it reads the 15 mark. Here it is. You reach the 15 mark that's easily read because of the blood. You are now ready for the centrifuge step. You will notice you need a counterweight of 67 grams for the swing centrifuge. That can be an old sample filled with water, or that can be sand, gravel, whatever you like, provided you put say, 67 grams on one arm. You put your blood sample and you're gonna be ready for spinning three minutes.
We have a full separation of the blood into three different phases. The upper chamber contains the plasma, the lower chamber, the red blood cells. And you see here this intermediate phase, we name the buffy coat, containing almost all the leukocytes plus about 7 to 11 percent of the platelets. I'm going now to show you the way to use the World PRP tube as a super concentrator of platelets. You can that way select only the buffy coat. That will be done usually in ophthalmologic procedures. You simply twist the bottom and you're going to see the buffy coat coming up very gently. Once the buffy coat raises the upper neck exactly here, you just need to twist the upper chamber and that way you're going to be ready to aspirate only the buffy coat. So you just insert a 1 ml syringe in the middle shaft and then you will gently aspirate the buffy coat. I now gently use the connector. I'm going to take a little bit of plasma. So in this way, we obtain a very rich PRP containing almost all the leukocytes of the blood sample plus about 7 to 11% of the platelets.